Maker duo Justin and Eddie created the RC Ski. It's a radio-controlled device that allows you to wakeboard completely by yourself with no one else controlling the jet ski. Anything with the term RC has my interest, so I'm ready to dig in and see how this was designed. So this is the piece that we're going to mount on the ski to receive the signals right, and right. actually control the watercraft mm -hmm. from this piece. Yes. OK. Now, once this piece is mounted to the ski, we're going to use this piece, which is actually our handle we'll hold on to. And it's going to be tethered to the receiver via some ropes or cables. Right. Can we dig in here? Please. All right. OK, you ready? Yeah, pull it off. This is basically your standard 2.4 gigahertz RC radio system you'd right. find in planes Airplanes. or RC cars now. So this is actually the throttle. throttle. It's like a motorcycle, right? Can we take this apart? If you want to use it later. What makes the RC ski so unique is its watertight transmitter located in the handlebar. The makers engineered a one-of-a-kind system using a row of magnets on either side of aluminum tubing, which is housed in the throttle. When the throttle is turned, the magnets follow each other, sending a signal which communicates to the rest of the system whether to start, stop, or accelerate the jet ski remotely, ensuring a leak-proof device. We've got a cutoff switch, right. right? So that's like if you go down in the water, it turns off the craft Correct. and it stops. I got to admit, I'm just a little nervous, but I'm ready. So you ready? I'm ready. OK, let's do this. The RC ski makers claim that most people can learn how to use this product on their first try. So I'm anxious to see if Brooke can actually do it and if he agrees that safety is a concern. There he goes. OK, that's Bye, Brooke. All right, yeah, look at him go. He's getting that. Yeah, I don't think he's coming back. Brooke looks like he's ripping it up. Look at him. He's doing some donuts out there. He's either doing donuts or he lost control of the steering. <laughs> he's going pretty fast. He's moving. You could do that all day long. At first, some of the controls were a little tricky, but being able to tube and operate a jet ski at the same time completely by myself is awesome. Oh, Very man. nicely done, sir. Was it fun? Yeah, lots and lots of fun. To be honest, I did not have that throttle pegged at all. Our next version is definitely going to be a lot more intuitive with a push button instead of the, the wheel throttle. So I got the hang of how to operate the RC ski. But even though I haven't been on a wakeboard in years, I have got to try this out. I mean, that's what it was intended for. He's not almost, almost, almost there. Almost there. Uh oh, no. Clear the, clear the dock. Oh, he's up there. Oh, he's got it. Oh, oh, stop. All right, man, I have to give you an A for effort. That did <laughs> not look easy, dude. Yeah, it, w it wasn't easy. <laughs> but I mean, wakeboarding isn't easy. Right. Today, we proved it works. But I got to say, it's not exactly for beginners. But I think you've got a start of something that's really amazing. Thank you so much. Just because Brooke's not a good wakeboarder doesn't mean the RC Ski's not a good device.